Okay, if you could say your name for me, Stella. Joanne Depew, J-O-A-N-N-D-E-P-U-E. -N -N -E. Okay, and your title? Director of Data Assessment and Technology at Springville Griffith Institute. All right. Can you tell us about your role in supporting educational technology initiatives? At Springville, I think more than a support role, it's a planning role. Um, thinking about how to move the district into the future with all the mandates that are coming down between online assessment and park and trying to plan for all of the emerging technologies and how to make um, the best use of the resources, the limited resources that we have, but still allowing students to use the technology um, that's available to them as well as move forward curriculum. So we're spending a lot of time sorry, looking at our district's infrastructure and how to support um, not only coverage but density um, of users, looking at the number of possible devices that students could bring in and use. Uh, when we designed our original network, it was designed for coverage, so that we could put a wireless device in any area and make it work. But now when you're looking at two classes on the same wireless access point or kids bringing uh, BYOD, uh, our network won't support that at this point. So having to rethink our infrastructure of how we could possibly manage those um, devices and move everybody toward the future, along with providing a, you know, an adequate s amount of technology for everyone to be able to use. Um, you heard Ben talk about his projects. Um, what's your What's your approach when you work with Ben and when he approaches you with one of his projects? Um, we're pretty much the sky's the limit. Um, uh, a lot of our projects are, are student driven and uh, the students push the limits for us and we try and do what we can to make them happen. We try and use the resources that we have and kind of direct their projects to be able to use the resources that we have, but um, I don't think there's anything we haven't been able to do at this point. What trends? What projects or trends are you looking for in the future, in the immediate future? Um, we're really looking at uh, the video contest, um, having students in the video contest. We are also uh, having Marina Buhost come in. Uh, she is a speaker, uh, writer for immigration, and she does a pairing of fiction and nonfiction. And so she's coming to our school in January, and we're looking to get a group of kids to sit with her and read part of her materials and have a conversation before she presents to the teachers and, and does the workshop. So we really like to connect our students with people who are in the field um, and artists or residents, um, authors, technology, and how they all kind of fit together. And we do a lot of um, documentation of our projects so that we have them for the future. BD questions, iOS or Android? Android. Angry Birds, Words with Friends, Medal of Honor. Words with Friends. Uh, first computer? Um, high school, one of two that were in the district. Um, I can't even tell you what they were at this point. <laughs> Mac or PC? Um, I am PC. Favorite app? Favorite app, by necessity, is the navigation tool. <laughs> Great. Thanks. Good. Any other follow-ups? <laughs>